Hello and you good to go? No, I'm gonna switch this a little bit. Oh wow, you threw me off there. I was just getting into my thing, my spiel. Yeah, good, bad. better. Hello and welcome to the workshop. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate you very, very much. If you are new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. We upload a brand new video buckets. How often? Almost every single day. Almost every single day. Uh, if you love sneakers, you have come to the right place. You are in good hands. If you are looking for me outside of this little sneaker crevasse, this little valley of sneaker boxes, you can find me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok at Mr. Fomer Simpson. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that thumbs up button for us. Goes a long way, helps the channel continue to grow. We appreciate you for that. And last buckets, what's last? Uncivilized Store. Uncivilizedstore.com. Buckets, who is behind the camera, myself. We have a clothing brand, and that is where we sell it. So all links will be in the description of this video for your convenience. And with that said, Buckets, anything to add or are we diving in? Diving in. Three, two, one, bang, bang. This is the Oski Nike SB Dunk High Great White. These released last month and retail was 110 bucks. Shouts to our friends over at Kicks R For Us. They are a local resale shop down here in the Tampa area. I scooped this pair from them. Now, some of you may remember we did a review on the black pair a while back. Personally, I like this pair more, but they've totally flown under the radar. Buckets, do you agree? Like, I didn't even know these released until I walked into Kickstarter for us and saw these on the shelf. Yeah, I didn't know about them. Yeah, but you don't see, so you're in your own world. The mullet, the stash, you're worried, you're focused on cultivating those things and maybe not so much on every single sneaker release that drops. Yeah, I'm not that concerned with cultivating the the most the mustache. Oh, the mustache. Or the mullet. I'm not that concerned with it. Okay. It's just a regular thing. All right, but these did fly under the radar. Yes. I agree. For those of you who are not familiar, Oscar Rosenberg, aka Oski, he is a skateboarder from Sweden. This is now the second sneaker that he's done with Nike SB. That black pair I mentioned being the first. Obviously, the main feature is this shark swoosh. Some people love it, some people hate it. I know there are some who think the swoosh is sacred and should be left as is. I kind of like when people play around with it a little bit especially collaboratively buckets we've talked about it in previous videos i mean you've got the ben and jerry nike sbs the ambush dunks travis scott obviously he flipped the swoosh upside down that was pretty cool i'm forgetting other sneakers too uh, buckets would you say the sakai they fooled around with it a little bit yeah there's been different iterations of it this is like you know it's like a shark in a swoop a uh, swoosh shape yeah so it's almost like the next level of that shark soup i was like what where's this guy going with it culinary yeah some words you know sometimes i just doesn't flow how i want I, I i do feel you i like these there's really not a ton going on outside of the swoosh i mean it's an all white nike sb dunk high you've got this nice tumbled leather well it feels nice anyway i'm not a saddle maker i don't know what grade of leather it actually is you've got white laces 
a standard Nike SB tongue with the Nike SB Oski tongue tag. white ankle liner, red stitching along the top of the midsole here, which is a nice touch. And you've got the all white bottoms with another red hit. I do think the red really brings this shoe to life a little bit. It gives it a little bit of pizzazz. Now the shoe probably will get filthy but it's a really easy pair to rock, a really easy pair to wear. You know, you could throw them on with whatever and pretty much be good to go. It's a nice pair for the summer too. And we always talk about how colorways don't necessarily have to align with seasons, but I do feel, buckets, I do feel like you've gotta have a, at least a white sneaker in the rotation for the summertime. I agree, Maj Maj majority, uh, white on the color blocking. You kind of got to do it. You know, just picture this. I want you to visualize this. You're on a bicycle. No, we'll spice it up a little bit. You're in a Saab convertible. Whoa, okay. All right? You've got a mango icy in the left hand. You've got the latest iPhone in the right hand. You know, you're TikToking or something. You're on Instagram Live, what have you. So you're not driving in the Saab. You are driving in the Saab. You thought, you thought I was parked. I'm not parked. I'm driving safely. I do have the seatbelt on. Note that. Uh, but you're driving with your knee. You know how Pops used to do it back in the day? It's just, you're, you're cool guy in it. It seems very dangerous. You're going slow. There's no one really around. It's residential. So you're just hoping that maybe people are looking out their window at that exact time. Point being, what sneaker is on your, on your feet? Controlling the pedals, the levers. It's these. Okay. It's the Oski, Nike SB, Dunk High. Great white shark. There we go. Yeah, we throw the shark on to make it official. Um, I like them. I dig them. I think that this pair, like I said, I do think it's better than the black colorway. I don't remember what I rated those, so I may be putting my foot in my mouth here. I never, when I rate a sneaker. That's it. One second later, I couldn't tell you what I rated that sneaker. No, agreed. And the scale, it changes day to day. It doesn't change. Day by day by day. Well played. I'm giving these a seven out of 10. You know, in the words of a wise man, Salid, Salid, Se which, seven out of 10. Which wise man is that? Uh, what was that from? Uh, first, um, uh, 50 first dates or something? The oh. dude, the, 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 the one dude. Uh, Appy as a hippo? Yeah, Appy as a hippo. Okay. I think he a... says solid and he's saying Salid, Salid. Yeah, that's not 50 first dates. Damn, what was it? Uh, it's a movie with, I think that's Along Came Polly. Along Came Polly. I don't know, man. I, in the words of Mike Tyson, I don't know, man. Totally, we're, we're off the tracks right now. We're off the rails. Give me your score. I give seven out of 10. You give? Six and a half. Six and a half. You have to half down me. Okay. Uh, let us know how you feel. What are your thoughts on this colorway, this collaboration, this sneaker? How do you feel about Nike SBs in general? Dare I say, they seem to be losing a little bit of hype, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. These are reselling for like, you know, two, 300 bucks, uh, which isn't too bad considering what I feel like every Nike SB was reselling for a couple years ago. I mean, the black pair is going for like 600 plus, at least in my size. So these are a lot more attainable and affordable than those are. And I actually prefer them. So I like that. Fuck it, you have anything to add? I think that in that amount of time those came out a couple years ago yep so in a couple years these will be in that range i believe okay so there's nothing to add though so strike now is what you're saying if you want them yeah all right buckets has spoken uh let us know how you feel always love to hear from you thank you for watching you are very very appreciated we will be back tomorrow manana same time same place right here at the workshop with a brand new sneaker for your head top i got nothing else buckets nothing 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 M uh mustache tips uh, mullet tips, anything? I mean, let it flow. Let it flow. There it is. Put that on the screen. Let it flow. Life advice. Adios.